Hi guys, welcome to another edition of Journey with Josh. On this video, I'm going to tell you five things that I like about the MSC Meraviglia. Hi guys, thank you for joining me on this video where I'm going to tell you five things that I like about the MSC Meraviglia. If you like this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Um, so let's start this. The number one thing that I like about the MSC Meraviglia is the ship. This ship is gorgeous. It reminds me of one of the casinos in Las Vegas. It's glitzy, it's modern. Um, there are lots of options for people to do things such as food to the um, activities such as the, the water slides and the ropes courses, a um, couple of pools on the ship. Um, it's just there's, there's a lot of areas that you can go to relax, you can go to have fun. Um, just is a beautiful, beautiful ship. Love this ship from top to bottom. Um, I guess the only thing that I really don't like about this ship is kind of like the furniture in the room is a little bit Ikea-ish, so it's a little cheap, but other than everything else in the ship is gorgeous. Love it. Number two, my balcony cabin. I absolutely love this cabin. Um, I did a little bit of research to make sure that one, that um, the cabin would not have a lot of sunlight so that I could come out here and enjoy the weather. Um, in the Caribbean, if there's a lot of sunlight, it's going to be way too hot, especially in August, which is where I'm at now. So um, I chose the balcony cabin, but I also chose one that is in one of the corner of the bump outs. And the reason why is because the balcony is so much larger. Um, this balcony is probably nearly twice as large as the other balconies. Lots and lots of space. You could have a party here with about six, seven people outside of COVID times, of course. So I really love this cabin. Um, the cabin itself has a lot of space in it. It is modern looking. Um, the bed sleeps okay, not the best bed, but the bed sleeps okay. Um, the climate control and it is working very well. It has kept it really cool, which I love my room to be cool. The bathroom is probably about the same as most other bathrooms, maybe a shade smaller, but I like the shower. The shower basically does have a glass door enclosure um, not a pod, but a glass door enclosure, um, and definitely not no stupid shower curtain that sticks to you when you're trying to take a shower. So really love this balcony cabin. Number three, the food. You know, I came on this ship to um, find out why everybody complained about the food. And so far, I just don't get it. Um, my breakfast has, breakfast in the buffet is normal buffet breakfast food. I mean, it just is. And my bacon was delicious. Um, the eggs were okay. They're standard fare for a buffet. I actually got a fried egg and was surprised that the yolk was a little bit runny. Normally they're not. So the food itself is not bad. The pizza on this ship, which I'll talk about next, is really good. And last night I got the beef bourguignon in the um, main dining room and it was delicious. Um, I couldn't have asked for anything better. Um, but otherwise, it's standard cruise food. It's not gonna be fine dining, okay? So the food is decent, cruise food, nothing to worry about on that. I think that there's um, something for everybody. But I don't think that there's a big enough selection, especially in the buffet and even in the main dining room, there's not like a huge selection. So if you're used to um, a wide selection in the main dining room, um, you're not going to get that on MSC. You're going to get a few here and there on that. Basically, kind of like if you went to a fine dining restaurant, uh, you only get a small selection for that. Same thing, but the food's not as good as fine dining, but it's good. Uh, I enjoyed my dinner last night. Um, Number four, as I said before, I really like the pizza on this ship. The pizza on this ship is probably, it's definitely in the top two, if not the best pizza that I've had on a cruise ship. Um, I would say probably the next best would be Carnival's Pizza. 
Um, and the reason why is both of these pizzas are handmade. Um, both cruise lines, you get to watch them make the pizza, hand tossed and everything. Um, this right here is true to Italy pizza. You couldn't ask for anything closer. It is Italian pizza. So if you want authentic pizza, like from Napoli, this is what you're gonna get. It's really good. Um, I got the pepperoni pizza because I like pepperoni. Um, but they have margarita and a couple other things and it was super, super good. And if you want to, you can actually have it delivered to your room for $7.95, uh, a whole pie. Um, so yeah, pizza is delicious. I think you'll like the pizza. And finally, the fifth thing that I like about the MSC Meraviglia is the pool deck. The pool deck is spacious. They have the daybed loungers there for you so you can have one with a cushion on it or one without a cushion on it. Um, there is plenty of seating around the pool deck, so if you just want to sit and have a drink and enjoy the, the, the fresh air, you can do that. There's an overhang that keeps you in the shade, um, so you can enjoy that area. Um, they do have a large smoking section there, but there really weren't a lot of people smoking, so it wasn't that bad. Um, and then the other areas of the, of the ship uh, on the top deck are just very spacious and well laid out. Really like the pool deck. Um, a lot of room for activities whenever they do have activities. I've not seen any activities. Um, but yeah, the pool deck, I really like a lot. So those are the five things that I like about the MSC Meraviglia. If you like this video, again, give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. That helps me with the YouTube machine. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I need all the subscribers I can get. I'm trying to get to that magic 1,000. Again, thank you for tripping with me.